Hi and welcome to this practical 365 demonstration. My name is Siegfried Jagot and today I will show you how to manually install the hybrid agent preview on a computer. Well, as I said previously, this is preview software, so take care, it might change until the final release. Yeah, this is part three of my demo ser series about the hybrid agent and modern hybrid. In order to install the hybrid agent, you need to download the installer from the internet. This will always make sure you install the latest hybrid agent. So in order to uh, download it, you need to type in the uh, link maka.ms hybrid agent installer. Click return. This will bring you to the save. Yeah. You save it in a special folder, I recommend, because after you saved it locally, what you need to do is you need uh, to open the command prompt and run the command prompt as an administrator. Uh, this is required in order to have sufficient permissions to install the hybrid agent on your system. Then you change to the folder where you downloaded the hybrid service MSI2. So next, in order to install it, uh, you do type MSI exec slash i for install and type the hybrid service msi click return and now it will install the hybrid service so what's next is uh, the azure account uh, sign in screen will appear and you need to sign in as the administrator uh, the global administrator that you used in your tenant uh, to configure the hybrid configuration wizard so in my situation it's hybrid i type in the password and this makes sure the hybrid configuration wizard uh, or the hybrid agent here will um, connect to your uh, exchange online in an um, Azure tenant. Yeah? Collect all the necessary information, such as the certificates, and start communicating with the system. So once you installed it, you will see that the agent is available in the services and make sure it's started. Yeah? So here you see the hybrid agent is started and running. In order to verify that it's also communicated co correctly, we can use um, the commandlets that I showed to you, uh, for example, in the in part two of the series. So let's switch to my Exchange uh, server. Yeah, and here we run the commandlet. And remember, this commandlet is not uh, available in the system. You need to change to the Microsoft Hybrid Service folder in order to get it. You run this, yeah, you enter the global administrator, and voila, you see my new server is up and running and the status is active. So this concludes my demonstration about how to manually install the hybrid agent. Thank you for watching.